We pulled a sweet monster rookie auto out of this last month. Let's see if we can do something like that again. This is the $95 version, the modern Sapphire box. They do have different tiers. This is the only box or tier that you would say that I pretty much open up all the time. And the packs have been kind of different at times. And that's actually a first. Wow, the packs are actually in different stacks. Plus we got another pack on the top here. Sweet, we got another one of these guys. Looks like we got a couple packs there. Some Donruss in the middle. Big old fat pack there. Wow, we got a lot of a lot of packs, it seems like. We got three peanuts this time, so maybe that's will be three times the good luck. Alright, so we got 22-23 player of the day. 22-23 revolution. Believe that is hobby. That is. 22-23 prism. Should be fast break. Nice. 2021 Donruss. Looks like a hobby pack. There you go. 17, 18 Donruss. Good old Poop Brown in that one. That should be hobby, I believe. That's right. Older year sometimes didn't tell you. And 21, 22 Mosaic. That is going to be hobby. Wow. So let me know the pack value you think so far. We got a total of six packs here like i said this is a 95 dollar box they do have different tiers and that's 95 dollars shipped and you know what if the cost is too much for you you think the pack value is not there well you know what all i'm trying to do is show you what's all out there you can possibly buy and the packs do change every month so it could be different it could be better but do realize pack values have been going down so if you order it at the beginning of the month you know, you, next thing you know, pack values are be, maybe lower, right? So just take that into account. I'm not promoting TCC. I just want to put out their stuff because I like opening up sub boxes. And I've had some good pulls throughout the times. And it definitely is a lot of fun. And that's all that matters as long as you're having fun. All right, so enough talking spurs. Let's start off with this 22-23 NBA play of the day. I do have some of my Tim Duncan PC back there. For the national with the national going on i figured you know what let's put some of my rainbows i am looking for the one-on-one -on -one of this guy if you've seen it believe it or not that's actually out of five and that's out of ten but then the mem card over here is actually out of five so uh panini <laughs> you probably can guess your guess is as good as mine when it comes to their thought process but maybe you know i'll be lucky and pick up some packs we'll see we got a nice Jalen Brown here. And I think it might just be a base card of T Mac. Tracy McGrady, nice. Let's go to everybody's favorite 1718 Donruss. Poop Brown here. Definitely looking for some stars in this year. Looking for some investments from 1718. The number one guy from 2017, and you've heard me talk about him in previous episodes, Lonzo Ball. Nikola Vucevic, Tyler Lydon, Red Rookie, Joel Embiid, Harry Giles. I feel like I've opened a very similar pack to this before based on the rookies we've been getting. Eric Bledsoe, Cork Kings, parallel of CJ McCollum. Doesn't look very happy there. That might be all the rookies we're going to get. Dwayne Wade. Greg Monroe, Jamal Murray, a second year. We'll throw that down there. Notable stack. And Mello. Is he the right Mello? Is the Mello the right Mello? Let me know down in the comments who you think the right Mello is between Carmelo and LaMelo Ball. Let's move to that Revolution pack. I'm a big fan of Revolution 22-23. You get so many cool parallels. Maybe we'll hit that one Galactic from a case. That'll be the day. When that happens, maybe I'll retire from opening packs. All right, we got a Keegan Murray. Little shockwave. Let's go to the back here. We'll save the hit. So you got Jalen Suggs. 
little cat, Carl Anthony Towns. Kind of didn't even show that. We got a, what? Did I skip a card? I was expecting a base. Did we get? Did we get? Oh, yeah. That, that third card was definitely, it said, this autograph is guaranteed by Panini? Nice. Got a Mark Williams auto. The third card, which I was expecting to be a base card. So I wonder what this next card is. Wow. Sweet. I wonder if that's numbered. I didn't see in the back the first time. Doesn't appear to be numbered. But nice. Wow. Definitely take that. Let's see a little third pack mojo. There's a shockwave. And see here. So it looks like we got a Astro of, <laughs> speaking of, not happy, CJ McCollum. <laughs> nice. A little Astro there. Nice. That was actually a sweet pack. Got a nice little rookie auto, you know, with actually a pretty decent signature compared to most of the guys these days. Take the card and put it in the sleeve. A little Mark Williams. I've never heard of this guy. If you know anything about him, let me know down in the comments. Let's move to Donruss. 2021 Donruss. We are looking for next day autos. We are looking for some mellows. The, uh, La Mello Ball, uh, Anthony Edwards, James Wiseman. Each hobby box comes with two autographs. I think next day autos, I believe, are case hits. We're going to get a lot of base. And speaking of CJ McCollum again, so nice. He showed up thrice. Definitely the CJ McCollum hot box when it comes to opening up here. We'll go through the base a little quickly, stopping at any notable cards. Jared Culver, Draymond, uh, not a big fan of Draymond. Jonathan Isaac, speaking of why I'm not a big fan of, Jordan Poole, newest member of the Wiz. I think he's the newest. I'm not sure if they picked up anybody else after they got him. Luke Kennard. We got a little RJ. All right, so here comes our stuff here. We got a backwards card. Is that just a troll? It might be a troll. We'll do this on, on troll. One, two, troll. Got a close game warrant. James Worthy? Nice. We got a game one patch there for Jersey Kings. Wow, look at that. Nice game warrant for Lakers. Sweet, man. I'm getting multiple hits in this box. And we still got two packs left to go. We got a Nikola Vucevic. That is numbered. That is numbered upside down there out of 99. 51 of 99. Nice. Is that a numbered card? Press proof John Collins out of 349. Zero Gravity is Spider. Nice for that PC. Net Marvel is uh, Zach Levine. Nice. Man, this is actually pretty sweet. Donner's pack. Okay, G. Retro Series. Joel and Bean getting lots of nice vets here. All right, now we got our base. Base cards are severely underpriced. Saban Lee, Tyler Bay, Tyrell Terry. Peyton Pritchard, Tyrese Maxey, we'll throw him on the top, and Josh Green. All right, so we've got a, as far as for rated rookies, we got a Ty Tyrese Maxey, so that's actually pretty sweet. But man, that was actually a lot of nice inserts. Got a nice game worn patch. You don't ever see that anymore these days, most of the time. Last two, we got Mosaic. That is Hobby. You know, this, we'll end off with Mosaic. I think a lot of times we end off on the Prism. This time, we'll save the. We'll save that one for the end. 22, 23 Prism, fast break. We are looking for disco variations of nice rookies, especially of that guy. If y'all ordered up a collectible card club box, let me know down in the comments what you all got. We got Scotty Barnes, Hamadou Diallo, fun guy. 
Dennis Schroeder. Don't want to give away the disco. The Monster Sabonis. Ah, oh, maybe I should have given it away. No, God, please, no, no, no. We got Ray Allen. At least it's on a Sonics jersey, so it could be worse. Nope. Actually, that may be the worst. Got a oh, nice little PC on us there, widescreen. Nice. That's sweet. Nice. Definitely been collecting a lot of his stuff. Rookie of Kendall Brown. And Kevin Garnett. Wow, we've been pulling, I feel like, a few of the same players throughout this tired opening. CJ McCollum, where have you been? I think you've been slacking on the last couple packs. Got our last pack here, 21-22 Mosaic. That is a hobby pack. There you go. This is... Uh, I think you can get two, no, or maybe one auto now. It's one auto in a box for Hobby Mosaic. Man, it's kind of a bummer that most Hobby pa not packs, but boxes only come with one auto. But maybe as card prices come down, you know, as stuff goes back to the way it was, you know, pre the kaboom, maybe they'll bring two back. Let's hope. Let's get into this last pack here. If you all missed my last box of Collectible Card Club, I'll leave a link for it down below and up at the top. We did pull an awesome rookie auto. Definitely was a monster. I was definitely so surprised about it. You could say a little a little PC auto. We got Mr. Zach Levine. Rookie of Brandon Boston Jr. Isaiah Jackson rookie. Scotty Barnes. Nice. Maxi Cleva, Devontae Graham, Joe Ingles, all right, let's see here, Devin Booker, I think we might be getting to where we're getting there, it looks like we can get a mosaic up next, let's see if we can get a rookie, we did get a rookie, not the rookie we'd want to get, but we got a Sandro, Sandro this guy, who I think is still on the team. Oh, I don't know. I have no idea where this guy's at. What an idiot! Let me know in the comments. I should probably know. But it is a Mosaic rookie. Let's see if we get another rookie. Nope. We got Andrew Wiggins. I think that just might be a red parallel. I don't believe those will be numbered. That is not. Got a, another Zach Levine. Stairmasters. Nice. Jelly Green introductions. Nice. I believe that's a mo mosaic parallel. I think you can get these in base cards too. Throw that there in the highlights. Got a Shea. Let's see if we can get one more rookie. Got a Giannis. And the last card for this break is going to be Aaron Gordon. All right, so let me know down below what you all thought of the, this month's Collectible Card Club box.